Here you go. And here's you guys a close-up shot of them. Hello, little babies. Now I've got them all ready to play. No, 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 stay in there. Check them out, guys. They are the sweetest little babies. Oh my goodness, guys. Look at this. So check it out, guys. I just opened up the incubator. Let's get this on tape. Come on out, little baby. Come on out, little baby. This is a baby mallard duck that is hatching before you. Can't believe I'm even getting this on tape. Let me stay back about right here to give you guys a clear shot. Come on out, baby. How cool is this? And at the same time, guys, we've got several other eggs that are currently hatching as well. Let me see if I can zoom back out just a little bit for you there. Get my hand out of the way. Come on in, baby. Here he comes, here he comes. Look at his little wing. Come on out, little baby duck. I actually collected these particular eggs here that are hatching on May the 13th. And today is June the 10th. So they are pretty much right on schedule. Look at his little beak. Come on out. Come on out. Back in 2008, guys, I used to raise ball pythons and probably haven't had a clutch of eggs since 2009, I would say. And this is the first batch of eggs that I have tried incubating of any type of animal since then. So this is super exciting. It's the first time I've ever gotten to see such a thing happening before me. And I'm uh, really, really glad and excited that I'm getting the chance to share it with everyone as well. That is so crazy, guys. Look how wet its little feathers still are. Come on out. Come on out. Come on out. I've got to finish setting their um, cage up outside. I've already got the lights hung. I've already got the starter feed ready. I've already got their watering bowl, but uh, once these guys hatch, I will get them some dry towels lined down at the bottom of the cage to help keep them dry and uh, get them fully set up. Come on now, little baby, baby, baby. Little baby, baby. Little baby, baby. Little baby, baby, baby. Little baby, baby. He's working hard. Come on out. Come on out. You little cramp for space, huh? I actually have a total of 22 eggs on incubation right now. Not sure how many of those will hatch. However, if all of these from May the 13th hatch, which it definitely looks like they are doing so right now, um, there's a good chance that we could even have a 100% success ratio for all hatchlings. I guess we'll have to stay tuned and I'll find out that together. Come on now. Come on. Here he comes. Here he comes. Come on. Come on. Baby, baby, baby. Baby, baby. Look at him trying his best to get out of that egg. Should I go ahead and try to give him a hand? Come on, little baby. Come on, little baby. Come on. Come on. Little 
Here you go. And the first baby duck is officially out of the egg. Come on, little baby. Come on, little baby. There you go. There you go. There you go. Check it out, guys. A brand new baby mallard duck. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? Look at its little beak. I've got to go outside and get all this stuff set up, guys. Stay tuned. We'll have a lot more of these hatching. Good Wednesday morning to everyone, guys. Check it out right there, and you can see a baby mallard duck pipping through the egg. Look closely here, and I'm going to try my best. Let me back up so I don't get my shadow overcasting. Look, look, look. There's his big. Hello, little baby, baby, baby. Baby, baby, baby. Baby, baby. Maybe right there. Once again, guys, this is a baby mallard duck pipping from the egg. I would say that this duck will be completely out of its egg here in a matter of maybe a couple of hours. I've got another one right here in front of it that should be hatching today as well. You can already see the where it's going to pip through right there, it looks like. All these here have been placed in here at different times. We've got one here that was placed in here on May the 14th, and it should be hatching here probably tomorrow or the next day. So I just wanted to show you that one pipping, and let me show you the two that hatched yesterday morning. And right here are the two babies that hatched yesterday morning. Baby babies. Baby, baby, babies. Watch this. My little baby babies. 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 Babies, little babies, baby babies. Look at the little babies. And they're doing good guys. They've been hanging out here under the light mostly, but as you can see right now, they're not directly under the light. They have been exploring their cage. They're eating this new starter feed and I've been keeping them fresh water back there as you can see in their water container. You can actually see them pecking around on the starter food right now. Hello, little babies. Hello, little babies. Hello, little babies. And here's you guys a close-up shot of them. Hello, little babies. Hello, little babies. Oh, yeah, they're little babies. Look how little their beaks are, guys. Look at that. Okay, I'll put you down. Yeah, they're little babies. Now I've got them all ready to play. No, 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 stay in there. See, that's why I made these, I cut these rubber pieces off these old gym mats, guys, and enclosed that cage right there to help hold humidity in, as well as not let those little babies slip through those cracks. Oh, real quick, before I end this video, let's step outside here and see how the baby geese are doing. Where my little babies? Where my little babies? Where my babies? Baby babies, baby babies, they're my baby babies. Babies, babies, my babies, my babies, baby, baby, babies, babies, my little babies, my little babies, yeah, my little babies, we are doing, we are doing pre babies, what are them pre babies doing, huh? We are doing pre babies, we are doing pre babies. Check them out guys, they're growing like weeds, man. They've been staying out here on their own now. This is about their third night. I haven't been putting them in the cage at night. They stay in the water, I watch them on the cameras. They're doing a great job. They're swimming all over the pond now on their own. What are y'all doing? Come here and see me, come here and see me. You want me to hold you? You want me to hold you, my baby? Yeah, they're my baby, they're my baby. Yeah, they're my baby, they're my baby. Yeah, there you are. 
Yeah, there you are. There's that pretty baby. There's that pretty baby. Pretty, pretty baby. Check them out, guys. They are the sweetest little babies. Um, everyone says they get kind of mean as they get older. But as of right now, that's one of the sweetest babies that I've ever seen. Oh, yeah, you're my little baby. <laughs> And you can see Mr. Jealous has to come up here. This is Smokey. What you doing, my good boy? Yeah, you're my good boy. He's a good baby. That's my good baby. Yeah, are these your friends? Are these your friends? Yeah, are you friends with the geese? Yeah, you are. What are you doing, babies? What are my babies doing? What are my babies doing? What's them sweet babies doing? Uh, oh, look at that pretty baby. Yeah, look at that. Watch, watch, watch. Watch, look at that. Look, look. Already running that cat off. Can you believe that, guys? This young. And that cat backs up, too. What are y'all doing? Y'all the sweet little babies. Yeah, y'all are so sweet. If you didn't know, guys, these are baby Chinese geese. Um, the man that I got them from said they were about three and a half weeks old. That was Saturday, I believe, when I got them. So these geese should be approximately four weeks old now. And here comes Millie, the other jealous one. I hope you guys have enjoyed seeing the baby ducks pipping and hatching and actually seeing the baby ducks themselves as well as my Bill Murray hair from Kingpin and the baby Chinese geese because guys, I really love those things. And I appreciate you guys taking time to spend with me in this video. And I can't wait to talk to each of you once again inside that next video.